And welcome everyone, I am the Zember89 and welcome back to the Blackwell Legacy, where we're uh, playing uh, Lauren, and she smokes all the time, and there's Joey, and we're in a very, very jazzy bar. Let's talk to the piano player. What am I supposed to do, blow in his ear? He's not really my type. I didn't realize we were still Joey. <laughs> let's, uh, let's have Lauren talk to him. Hey, mister. Yes? Hey, Got mister. For a pretty thing like you, I got several. Huh. So huh. What brings you here on such a sad night? What brings a pretty little thing like you here in this uh, incredibly empty bar? The truth. I'm on a case. I'm on a case. Is that right? Oh yes. Very top secret. Sounds dangerous. Mm. Very. A guy could get into trouble hanging around a girl like you. Definitely. And Lauren, what's your name? Pleasure is all mine, Lauren. You can call me C. C. You got it, sister. What does the C stand for? It's okay for me to talk to you like this. I don't hear anybody else complaining. Dull night, huh? You could say that. But I think it just got a bit more interesting. Is that right? Well, these lips don't lie. Is that right? So charming. Um, what's your name, really? Is that C like the water? That's C like the chord. It's the first chord I played, and you never forget your first. Ain't of that course the not. Truth. <laughs> okay, okay. You know any other musicians? I do run in those circles, yeah. Any of them play here? Sometimes we get major gigs here. But me, I'm what you call the dependable type. These fingers can go all night. Oh dear. <laughs> Can they now? Oh jeez, make him stop. <laughs> Please make him stop. Um, what the, who's in the photograph? There, I saw you sneaking a peek at the lady on the piano. What's the band in that photograph behind you? That picture is old, sister. It's not that old. Old enough. Before my time is over. I don't think so. You were right there. I'm looking for info about a musician. Well, I'll try to help you out. Who is he? I don't know his name. I think he's a sax player. I know lots of sax players, sister. Big guy, kind of chubby, has a beard. Dead. Nope. Doesn't <laughs> ring a bell. You know, dead, blue, uh, out of the scene, dead as a doornail. Okay. See you around. Anytime. See you around. So, uh, we're we not don't... Here to... We're not here to relax. What about we're not here to drink either, apparently. Let's look at all of the photos. Hmm. This one looks interesting. Does it now? Okay, we already saw this one, and that's definitely him, isn't it? The woman is blocking the piano player. I can't see his face. Hmm. But that's definitely the ghost that we saw. But the, the only woman thing holding up that dress is fate. Pretty yep. girl, though. He should know. Hey, C. Hey, C. Hello there. I like the way his eyebrow <laughs> just goes up. It's like that smile. Oh, God. Do you have a copy of that photograph anywhere? Nope. Sorry. Hmm. I don't trust you. You seem to be lying. See you around. Anytime, sister. Anytime, sister. I don't think Joey can do anything except blow in his ear, which he doesn't want to. Bad Joey. So what can we do now? Johnny Ivory. That's where we were. That's where the ghost is. But, we have a handy-dandy, uh, yellow pages. So where's that Jambalaya records thing? We can go visit them. Jambalaya records. Here we go. Here we go. Jambalaya records. 240 Essex Street. I'll jot that down. Jot that down. And let's go out again. Into the night. Totally Mom, safe. Let's get out of here. Let's get right out of behind here. behind you. So totally safe. Jambalaya Records. Oh, nice. This looks re really good. It's the front door. Of course it is. Go in. <clears throat> Hiya. Good evening. Good evening to you. I'm Dwayne. Lauren Blackwell. I was hoping you could help me. I'll do my best. What can I do for you? What can I do for you? That sounded Russian for some reason. Never mind. So what is this place? This? This is a music agency. Music agency? We manage bands, do promotions, things like that, you know? You know? Well, by we, 
I really mean me. You do this all by yourself? Yep. One man operation. That's me. Why does it seem like all the adventure games that I play f figure some sort of Jamaican accent? I don't know why. Broken Sword 2 pops up to mind. What sort of music do you manage? Mostly jazz and reggae. Nobody famous. Most small timers have trouble getting their foot in the door. Getting gigs in small clubs, helping with recording sessions, you know. The basic stuff that musicians don't want to deal with. I see. You're open late. Really? Yeah, I suppose I am. I learned to work musician hours, you know. You play a gig at night and have a problem? You want someone to call? Your clients have lots of problems, do they? Don't get me started. What kind of problems do they have? Do they have a problem uh, of the deadish nature? I'm looking for a sax player. Well, I can definitely help you there. You looking for a stand-in or something more long-term? Oh, no, sorry. I'm not with a band. I'm looking for a specific sax player. A dead well, one. if he's a client of mine, I can help you. What's his name? That's the problem. I don't know. But he's in a hmm. photograph that your company took. Really? Can I see it? No. I don't have it. Then I don't know what to say. Oh, I know what to do. Thanks Goodbye. For the Goodbye. 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 Go. Go, girl. I know what to do. Bab, open the door. Yes, keep, nah, keep Joey out of it. Let's exit, go back to the bar. Bad across town. I know what to do, yes. Use the, not, use the camera. Camera, camera, camera. On the photo. There we go. And now we have the photo to show. This is a jambalaya. Hey, I was here five minutes ago. I have the Hi photo yeah. now. Hi, you. Hi yourself. Hey, can you come with me to Johnny Ivory's? I'll show you that photograph I told you about. No, we have I it. I wish I could, you know. But I have a ton of work to do. Maybe another time. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Thanks for the help. I well, might be back. Well, no we have the photo, don't we? Yes. It's the photo from Johnny Ivory's. Perfect. Use it. Do you know this band? Oh, yeah. I remember those guys. The C Sharps. That was the band's name? Yeah, I used to manage them. You used to manage them, but not anymore? Why? Nah, been about eight, ten years. Time flies, you know. Notebook updated. Thank you. T time flies, yes indeed. Tell me more. Hi, again. Hi yourself, again. Again. So that definitely means that that C guy was in the C sharps, right? What can you tell me about the C-sharps? Oh, they were strictly lounge jazz, you know? But I saw them doing more. They really gelled, you know? Gelled? In tune with each other. And that lady had a voice like velvet. What happened to them? Don't know. They disappeared. Oh. Got them a few gigs and cut a record and that was it. Guess they just moved on or just broke up. It happens, you know? I, I guess so. What was the sax player's name? Ah, uh, well, it was a long time ago. I'm not much on individual names. I just remember the band. I only deal with the leader, you know? So who is the leader? Uh, sorry. You don't remember that either? It was a while ago, Oh, you come know. on! You should remember this. You were their manager. Thanks for the... I might be back later. No problem. No problem. Jesus. So what do we do? Case list. Don't need that. Can we... S the ghost was definitely in the C-sharps. The Promenade Ghost once played in a band called the C-sharps. Yes. Great. Now what do I do with that? <laughs> oh, already stuck. Let's go back and talk to Mr. C. Mr. C, I have more information that you didn't tell me about. Hey, C. Hello there. Hello there. Do you know anything about the C-sharps? Oh. The c sharp. He does. Nah. Nah, I've never heard of it. Lies. <gasps> Lies. About that sax player. Yeah. He's in that photo behind you. Is he now? Yeah. 
Do you know him? Yeah. That picture is old, sister. It's not that old. Old enough. Before my time is all. Don't know who that is. Sorry. I think he's lying to me. Are you sure you don't know anything about the C-Sharps? There's a picture Positive. of him right behind you. Lots of pictures appear on that wall. I just work here. I don't know its entire history. Now, you mind? I got a gig to finish. I got a gig to finish. I don't believe you. But yeah, I don't know how to get you to tell me the See truth. I think you're in that photo, though. He already knows about this photograph. Yeah. Joey, can you do anything? Hmm, this one looks interesting. Take a closer look. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. It's our sax playing spirit in the flesh. Whoever that is, I can't see him. Especially with such a pleasant distraction getting in the way. Okay, Joey, calm down. Hmm. What am I supposed to do? He's not re Not really my type. Hey, this is a classy joint, dollface. We ought to come here more often. Yeah, we should. It looks like an amazing place. Nope. I can't leave unless she goes with me. Fine. Lauren, we have to leave. Hmm, who should we talk to? Let's go back home and see if we can find any information on the C-Sharps, and then I might go talk to the ghost again. C-Sharps. There's no entry for that. No, I didn't think there would be. Maybe we can find out what his name was. Come on, let's get out of here. Right behind you. Uh, Roosevelt Island Promenade. Oh. Oh boy. Who is We've that? We've got company. Who's that? Can you see? Pardon? Can't you see? See what, lady? The whole of the world. Connections, patterns, pulsing with life everywhere. Oh, great. One of New York's finest crazies. Yeah. Do something about this old bat, will ya? Shoo! Look, I'm a bit busy right now. I don't have time for this. Fool! Liar! Can't you see? Um... Useless! Useless! What's your problem? Ow. I know. Only in New York. Yep. Only in New York. Well, I bet she won't be important at all. She was just a random character right there. Never mind. Ugh, forget it. Okay, Joey, you need to talk to him. You need to grab his saxophone. Hello again. Hello again. I said let go of that. No. Uh, what is C sharps? Tell me about the C sharps. What are you, crazy? Crazy? Get out of here. Get out of here! Oh god. Ow! <laughs> Sorry about that, Joey. Hey, kid, come here. Come here. We gotta, yeah, Joey? We gotta talk. So what do you think of our guy? Him? I don't think he wants to be saved. Really? Look at him. He seems peaceful enough. I say we just leave him. You know we can't do that, sweetheart. Yeah, I know. I'm just cranky and tired. Is that right? It's hard to tell with you. Be quiet. Be quiet. If you got a haunt a place, I can't think of a more perfect spot. I don't think he's paying attention to the view. Hmm, what a waste. It's true. It's a pretty nice place to haunt. Looks like our night won't be so easy after all. Disappointed? Nah. Not like you have more things to do. I wonder if the C sharps were any good. Guess we'll never know now. Oh, we will. We will. At some point, I think. That's all. All right, let's get on with it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. What are we gonna get on with? Nope, I can't. I don't leave here until. Yeah, yeah. I don't think. Exit. So where should we go now? Hmm. Well, I think Mr. C is lying to me, and the Jambalaya Records Dwayne doesn't remember a thing. Yo. Hi again. Hi yourself. Again. Again. Uh, he's, he's just gonna tell me the same thing, isn't he? Are you sure you don't know the sax player's name? Yeah, sorry. I don't think I ever spoke to him. 
Quiet fella, born to play the sax. That's all I know. All right. So you don't know what happened to the sea sharks? I don't know. They moved on or broke up. It happens. Thanks for the help. I might be back later. No problem. I might be back later when I have a goddamn idea on what I have to do. Hmm. Cigarette pack. We should light up, probably. So, Lauren, don't you, like, ever sleep or something? Hmm. That dude is not being honest with me. I don't know what else to do. Hmm. Ah, she's just gonna look at the same photo. Hmm. Hey, C. Hello there. Hello there. About that. Yeah. Are you sure? Positive. Positive. About this. I said I don't know him. Oh dear. Leave it be. He's getting angry. About the sea shark. I said, leave it. So he definitely knows who they are. He just doesn't want to tell me. See you around. Anytime, sister. Anytime, sister. He seems to be. He seems to be enjoying him. Okay. He's a swinger past his prime. Not bad on the piano, though. Yeah, I not bad. I just wish he'd keep his eyes on the keys. <laughs> Joey, are you getting jealous? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Yeah, okay, we already saw this. What do we nope, have to do? I can't. I'm thinking we have to research something in our apartment. I do not know what. Ash pail. You've got ash trays and pails everywhere. Flowers and now it's an ashtray. Perfect. That's the perfect use for it. Joey, any hey, ideas? Joey. Come here. Yes. I love the music in this game. It's just so relaxing. I really need to get a bigger place. You think so? I find this place quite cozy. So do I. That's the problem. I see. Well, I don't know. What do you do for a living, by the way, to pay for all this? <laughs> I need a change in my life, Joey. A change? The day-to-day -day grind of freeing tormented spirits getting too boring for you? No. I'm thinking of changing the wallpaper. How does pink sound to you? Pink? You're not a pink person. It would brighten up the place. No pink. No pink. That's it for now. Yeah, we'll talk more later. Hmm. I still think that's... No, don't look up anything. You can look up... Hmm. Star Wars. There's no entry for that. Wasn't it around the time when Star Wars came out? I have no idea. I'm not caring. Come so, on, let's get out of here. Right behind you. So for about the fourth time tonight, we're gonna go to the bar. That sea guy must be getting tired of us. Johnny Ivories. Now I'm gonna put Joey to do some snooping around. As he won't blow in his ear, he won't look at the photos, not much else to look around, but the sheet music. What do we have here? He's written something at the top of the sheet. Property of Cecil Sharp. Aw, how sweet. Maybe his mommy signed it for him. Aw. Perfect. So now we have his name. Cecil Sharp, a.k.a. C. Hey, C. Hello there. Hello there. About the C. No, 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 no. Is your name Cecil Sharp? Now, who went and told you that? Oh, you could say a little bird told me. Tweet, tweet. Well, you won't go tell tweet, nobody, tweet. will you? <laughs> Lips are sealed. So, Cecil. Cecil. Oh man. That hurts, sister. That really does. <laughs> Sorry. We're not gonna talk about anything? Yeah, okay. So, oh, that hurts. Cecil. So, we can go back to ja Jambalaya, ja Jambalaya Records. And we can tell him the foreman's name of the band. You're welcome that we're gonna remind you the band that you managed. Hi again. Hi again. Hi yourself. Again. again. 
Does the name Cecil Sharp ring any bells? You know, that name does sound familiar. Thank you! But, ugh, I'm so awful with names, you know? Is he part of a band? Maybe. He plays piano at Johnny Ivory's. Ah, uh, I deal with them all the time. But that's not where I heard the name. Hmm. This is going to bug me all night. Well, it might be because he was in the C sharps, you know, C so sharp, C sharps. So you don't know it. I don't. They moved on. Oh, you can't make the connection, really? Thanks for. Th okay, we can make the connection for you. Cecil Sharp, the C sharps. Cute, real cute. Yep, there we go. We made the connection. Now you'll know. Hi again. Hi yourself. Again. again. Here you go. This is the band he was in. Was Cecil Sharp in the band the C sharps? Cecil Sharp. C sharps. Yes. Yes. I knew I heard the name from somewhere. So do you remember him now? Oh yeah, he was the band leader. A genius on the piano. A genius on the piano. Are you sure you don't know? Th yeah, quite. Okay, so he still doesn't know the sax player's name. But we have Thanks for that. No pro more information on Cecil Sharp now. This is turning out quite, quite a night, isn't it? We go to records, and then to bar, and then to home, and then to bar again, it's bar, 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 bar. Uh, Cecil, were you in the band, in the photo, hey, behind C. you? Hello there. What can you tell me about your old band, the C-Sharps? Busted. C-Sharps? Can't help you there. Never heard of them. Now, I know that's a lie. I spoke to your old manager, he confirmed who you are. You spoke to Dwayne? Yep. Yes, I did. That fine. Fine. You got me. Yes. I used to run a band called the C Sharps. It was a rotten time in my life, and I'd just as soon forget it. Why are you stirring up these old ashes, huh? I have my reasons. Yeah, sure you do. Do you know um your sax player's name? About that sax player. Yeah. He's in that photo behind you. So I know he's with the C Sharps and that you know him. What is this? You from that damn magazine? What magazine? magazine? The New Yorker. You a reporter? No. So who is he? You just don't quit, do you? Nope. You want to know so bad? Yeah. His name is Isaac Brown. Isaac Brown? Yes. You happy now? Ecstatic. Great. Great. Now we know the ghost's name. So, uh, were you, uh, questions? Questioned by a New Yorker reporter? Who is the reporter? I don't know. Mitchell something? Mitchell Slow something. Talk. Drove me crazy. You think he killed Isaac? I just played the piano. I don't oh. think anything. Especially not the past. Whoever did Isaac, the son of a bitch had it coming. So please, just get out of here. Hold on now. Isaac was murdered? About that report. I know nothing of Southern guy. Talked real slow. Asked a bunch of questions. Just leave it. Okay? I'll never leave it. About that report. Ah. just... What can you tell me about Isaac Brown? Him? He's a bum. A drunk. A nobody. A lowlife. He's also dead. Yeah. And how did he die? Someone strangled him to death with his bare hands. Oh. Isaac must have squealed like a pig. You don't seem very upset by this. No, but last time someone asked about Isaac, it was some reporter from The New Yorker. He came along, asked his questions, then BAM! Isaac's dead. Oh dear. Really? Yeah. So forgive me if I don't take kindly to pushy questions. Oh, so uh, the sax ghost was strangled, folks. That's pretty bad. I had no idea he was murdered. About Isaac- Leave it. The past is dead, gone, and buried. Fine, we'll leave you alone. I, I don't think you can tell me any more. See you later. Yeah. Yeah. No more sweet talk, eh? I don't know, should we talk to Dwayne now? That we know- his name was Isaac Brown. Brown. Isaac Brown. Hi again. Hi yourself. Again. That sax player from the C-Sharps. His name was Isaac Brown. Does that mean anything to you? No. Sorry. I remember the sax player. But I'm quiet, fella. Fine. Did you know he was also murdered? Did you murder him? Do you read the New Yorker? The New Yorker? No. 
Not really my thing, you know. So you've never heard of a reporter named Mitchell, then? Nope. Fine. So you're not- you're useless Thanks now. Thanks for the help. I might be back. No problem. I will never be back later. Let's get out of here. Hey, maybe the ghost will, uh, will say something different now. Joey, grab his saxophone. As usual, and get uh, punched in the face. I'll be back. Oh, we can't? Hello again. Hello again. I said, let go of that. No. Get out of here! Oh, wow. Ooh. Ooh. So we can't talk to him about anything now. How about how am I gonna help you? Hello. I what do you know about a reporter named Mitchell? Mitchell. I'm not sure. He's a nice man. He asked, he asked me about, about my life. He killed you. <laughs> he bought me a drink. Gave me ten dollars. He strangled hey, you. Hey, hey, what are you what doing on stage, stage, man? Oh, here we go again. Get, Get out of here! Bam! Right in the kisser. Ow! <laughs> oh, poor Joey. Let's do it again. I see. You're Isaac Brown, aren't you? What's, What's it to you, you, man? So you are Isaac Brown? How do you know me? Get away! Get away. Get out of here! Oh, bam! Da, <laughs> da. Okay, so we spoke to him about that. Lauren, any ideas? Hey, kid. Come here. What is it now? Hmm. You know, I really don't have anything to say. Hmm. Hmm. Our friend Isaac has certainly given us a run for our money. He sure is. No, Joey. I think we've nearly cracked this one. You think? I hope so. Famous last words. <laughs> I hope so. I guess we gotta try and find this reporter, huh? That's the way these things usually work. Okay. Well... Uh, Alright. Yeah. My only idea is just to search him in the yellow pages. Nope, I can't leave the kids... I don't... With Lauren. Do 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 Let's go home. And use our trusty yellow page, yellow page book thing, and let's search for the New Yorker. Yep, there's a listing for the New Yorker. Their main office is in Midtown. Are we gonna go there? I have no idea. Mitchell, New Yorker. There's no entry for that. Hmm. <clears throat> what about the newspaper? Today's paper. It's tabloid crap. Is it the New Yorker? We've already looked through this. We don't need... Fine. Did we get a lead? Come on, let's ride. No, we still have these locations. Well, in the next episode, guys, I'm gonna figure uh, where this Mitchell dude is and probably why he killed the lovely sax player. Thanks for watching.